Hey, what's up, guys? Today I'm going to bring you a different kind of review. Um, I'm going to bring you a review on uh, the Limitless mod that I received. I received two of them. One brass, one aluminum with three different sleeves. And I got to tell you guys, these are the harder, hardest hitting mods I have ever hit. Um, I got a custom chuff cap also to match my, my mod from TWBC... Uh, company they hooked it up with a dope ass chuff cap and I'll show you this right now put them at it together I'm gonna show you some claws for it from it it's like a red wood grain and I got the red wood grain drip tip to match it this is on my tro troll solid copper button there's no way you're gonna get a hot button from this mod no arcing no hotness nothing I'm running a 0 0.08 on this right now and my mod doesn't heat up it doesn't get warm none of that any issues that you've had from previous mods you're not gonna have with this they changed the game with this mod let me show you a little bit of cloud I wasn't even trying let me try let me see No warmth at all whatsoever. This shit is sick. This Addy is a direct contact Addy, which means this Addy is going directly to the battery. It's a hybrid. So, straight to the Addy, the battery touches. The button, solid. That's it. Twist this off. It's specially designed, if you see those two notches right here, two slices in it. To where your button does not spin and fall off while vaping. I've had that happen so many fucking times and it's so annoying. I hate vaping. Going to push a button, you push the button so much or you do something so much, it just pops out and you're like, what the fuck? So you have to fix it. That'll never happen with this. Ever. If I push the button out, you see there's a little ring that goes around it. That right there is perfect because it keeps the button from falling out plus the notches in it doesn't allow it to spin black derlin ring twist it up in case you have battery rattle take this off sorry for my big hands in the view but I'm trying to show you guys if I had a better camera I would do it better comes off there's your button look at that twist this little ring off I'm about to show you guys the button twist this little ring off the little aluminum ring they also have magnets for it so but they went with this thick ass spring This is your button. Look at that. Solid copper. Yeah. Look at that. That's your firing button, people. So, they also have magnets, like I said, they go go for this. Um, I think I have magnets that'll fit it, but I haven't even tried it yet. But yeah, look, look at the, the design. No spinning of the button. It's uh, it, I, I can't tell you enough good things about this mod. Um, I love them. I love them. These and my SPL are the only two two mods I use. Um, I'm in love with this mod. 
if you guys want a good comp mod, I suggest you jump on these. Um, I believe they retail for like <sighs> like 120 and up, which is really, really affordable. I mean, shit. I used to be a clone dude. I mean, I still am. I'll rock some clones. You know, don't don't get me wrong. But for 120, I would have to go with this beside before a clone. Definitely, I know clones. You know, clones are out there. They're 20, 30 bucks. You know what I mean? But if you want quality, then why not? Interchangeable sleeves. That's what I like about it. Hey, I'm wearing a black shirt today. You know, I think I want to fucking put on a black sleeve. Well, here's my brass one that they sent me. I put my aluminum firing button on it. With the black sleeve. Look at how beautiful that is. I mean, shit. And if you're that type of person like me, very anal. I hate when I get a mod and I put my Addy on it. And the serial number or the name of the mod doesn't line up with the name of the Addy. It drives me crazy like the name's on the on the left side and my the name of the uh, the mod is on the right side. Nah. So, my Mephesto. The name of Festo's right here. Oh, I want my freaking name to line up with my mod so it looks even better. Line it up. Twist the button so it stays in place. Bam, there you go. I mean, shit. These mods are, are honestly limitless. Any color. They got so many fucking colors for it. You could get a sleeve for every day of the week, every day of the month. You get a sleeve to match your outfit, your shoes, your uh, your hat, your beanie, whatever. It doesn't matter. I mean, it's a beautiful, designed, smart idea, good quality mod to have. Um, I mean, this is my my this is my beast one right here. I love it. I believe we're running a dual 18 gauge on here. Let me get it wet. Um, dual 18 gauge, 5 wrap, on a Mephesto. It's just, it's a trip. The button doesn't get hot at all. The mod doesn't get hot. There's no heat transfer in this. Um, like I said, extra sleeves. Where's my other sleeve at? I had a red one. All right, here. Red. Living the sleeve. Hmm. I want red today. I got red shoes on. Or red hat. Pop it on. Oh, shit. I'm driving in my motherfucking caddy today. I want, I want it to match my wood grain. Bam. There you go. Matching your wood grain. And what's dope, like I think I said in the beginning of the video, I got a matching drip tip to match the red wood grain on this mod. Which I'm fucking super excited about. I mean, look at how beautiful that is. That's... I'm not trying to show off at all. I'm just amazed by how gorgeous this mod is. And have the matching chuff cap... Hot. Like. <clears throat> Beautiful. Beautiful. The best mods I have ever hit. Today. Today. Guaranteed. These hit so good, they're up to par with box mods. Um, not series mods, I ain't gonna tell you that. Because, I mean, I'm gonna be full of shit. But. Yeah. These mods, they're just fucking bad. Um, company that sent them to me, told them I was going to do a review on it, let you guys know. Um, they sent me the pricing, but they sent me wholesale pricing, so I got to get, you know, legit pricing for everybody, unless I decide to write it, run a group buy on them, then we can get them cheap. But, uh, man, the sleeves, I believe the sleeves are like 20 to $25 each, which isn't bad. These are made out of aluminum. So, I mean, this one right here is made out of, uh, I don't know the material. I'm going to, the same as the chef cap. Um, 
some kind of plastic or something, but it's it's really good made. Uh, yeah, man, that's that's my review on the Limitless mod. I mean, you guys make the choice. You guys gotta buy one and try them. And I can tell you where to get custom drip tips to match your mods. See if you can see that. The Wild Bills Company. <laughs> Gotta say, big shout out to them for the chuff cap. Uh, I'm just so much, so much happier because now my limitless mods look fucking gorgeous. They got everything to match. I'm very happy about these. Um, like I said, pricing is about 120 and up for these. Um, you guys will not be disappointed. I promise you that. Trust me when I say. These are two of the best mods I have ever hit, hands down. I can't tell you guys enough about them. I'm probably dragging on and saying the same shit over and over and over again. But you know what? I have nothing, nothing bad to say about these. Not a single thing. The next comp I go to... I'm taking this mod, and I guarantee you, I'm walking out of there with first place. This shit is fucking beast. So with that said, that was my quick review on the Limitless mod. They got brass. They got aluminum. And I gotta get my hands on the copper one. Um, I, I gotta see how hard that copper mod hits. If these hit that hard, I can only imagine what a full copper one does. Fuck, seriously. Big, big, big shout out to. Let me tell you the guy that sent me them. Because I gotta send him a link to the video. Because I want him to know that these mods are outstanding. I mean, like I said, the best mods I've ever hit. The best. So I wanna give a shout out to Justin Moreno. Thank you, brother. Thank you for letting me do a review on these mods. Thank you for hooking me up. Um, I'm going to put a link to his company, which is Vapor Hub International. That's www.vapor-hub.com. Hit them up. They got what you guys need. They got the sleeves. They got the mods. They got the copper one. Amazing. Thank you, guys, for watching this video jump on these mods i promise you if you take these mods to a comp you're gonna beat the fuck out of somebody because these mods hit hard voltage drop not there hot button not there hot mod not there like i said you could run a super sub ohm and this mod stays cool as a polar bear's butt and that is the truth um thank you guys for watching this video uh until next time just blow some clouds and I'll leave you guys with that.